More research has come out connecting Hashimoto's thyroiditis to Meniere's disease. What is Hashimoto's? That's where the immune system attacks the thyroid gland. Meniere's disease, as many of you know, is a condition affecting the inner ear, leading often to symptoms of disabling vertigo lasting on the order of hours, pressure and ringing in the ear associated with hearing loss, uh, unfortunately, it can become bilateral, involving both ears for a number of individuals. For a long time, Meniere's disease was thought to be genetic or idiopathic. We still know there are genetic cases, but we're now realizing a lot of the cases 20 years ago that would have been classified as idiopathic, now we're finding have an allergic or autoimmune causation. This might be important because, as I've discussed in other videos, a lot of our allergic and autoimmune immune system is located in our gut. And check out my content on Hashimoto's and Meniere's disease and vestibular migraines on these topics. Nonetheless, I'm attaching this article because it's hot off the press. It's more evidence substantiating this autoimmune link to Meniere's disease and or allergic. And this may be of help to a lot of people. Uh, none of this is medical advice. Consult with your doctors. Let me know though if you have any questions. I'm Dr. Randall Gates, board certified chiropractic neurologist, chiropractic physician from Gates Brain Health and Advanced Imaging Reno.